Good girl. Scott and Willow here. Have you ever struggled to make the perfect sparkling cocktail or add a dash of sweetness to your coffee? What if I told you the secret to elevating your drinks is as simple as a 90 second recipe? Today, I'm gonna show you how to make simple syrup with just two ingredients, a microwave and a spoon. It's only gonna take about 90 seconds. Okay, let's get straight into it. Okay, well, let's go. So here's everything that you need. You'll need one cup of water, and I'll touch on whether to use tap or distilled in a second. You'll need one cup of sugar. Granulated sugar will work. Take your one cup of water, and you might wonder whether to use distilled or tap water. Now, if you have great tap water like I do here in Portland, go ahead and use it. But if you live in an area where tap water has a strong mineral taste or additive, distilled water will give you a much purer flavor. Next, let's pop that water into the microwave. We don't want it to get too hot. We want it to get between 120 and 160 degrees Fahrenheit. And in most microwaves, it's gonna be around one minute. I get exactly 140 degrees in one minute in my microwave. You don't wanna caramelize the sugar. You just wanna get it warm enough so that the sugar will dissolve into the water quickly and evenly. I find around 140 degrees works perfectly. Let's hit that start button. So now that our water's warmed up to 140 degrees, I'm gonna grab our one cup of sugar and slowly pour it into the water while stirring. And at this temperature, this is gonna dissolve nicely as we continue to do this. And it's gonna look maybe a little yellow at first, but after a couple minutes, this will turn clear and settle and you'll have perfect simple sugar recipe. So looks a little cloudy right now. This is gonna be great. In just a matter of seconds, we've made our own homemade simple syrup. It may look a little cloudy or yellow at first, but this will turn clear in a matter of minutes you can pop it in the fridge where it will last up to a month refrigerated. Now you might be thinking, why not just grab store-bought syrup? This homemade version is super cost-effective. It's fresh, free from any preservatives. Plus you can control the sweetness. If you prefer a richer syrup, you can increase the sugar from one to one ratio to one and a half or two to one. The simple syrup is the base for so many other flavored syrups. Once you've mastered this, you can easily create your own custom vanilla syrup or try cinnamon or mint or even fruit in your simple syrup. Imagine creating the perfect vanilla syrup for your morning coffee or mint syrup for your summer cocktails. The possibilities are now endless that you know how to quickly make the base simple syrup. And there you have it, a 90 second simple syrup recipe that's not only quick and easy, but also the foundation for so many other flavors. If you've enjoyed this, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more tutorials on everything bubbly.